from the mouse nest. All right, so we're cleaning out the camper van and I found the gray water tank. All right, so we've had the van for a few days. I replaced a couple pieces of the electronics, um, the starter relay, voltage regulator, and another ballast resistor. I got a new battery. What I'm gonna do here is, is I'm gonna try to jump, not jump start it, but basically hotwire it because the ignition is gone and just to see if it cranks over. So let's see if it does. All right, so after cranking and cranking and cranking, it cranks a lot, but it just wouldn't start. Um, I wasn't getting any fuel, so I put some fuel in the cap. Still wouldn't start, still no fuel. In the, there's a nice little see-through um, fuel filter that I could see, just no fuel. Um, so I noticed, oh, it's not doing it, of course, but where the fuel filler neck connects to the fuel tank, the hose is all rotted out. So I'm gonna have to get that before I can put some fuel in it. Good thing is, is since all the fuel's out of it, I don't have to drain any rotten fuel that's been sitting in there for 10 years. All right, so when I came back with that piece to connect the fill tube to the tank, there's a lot of yucky stuff up there. So I figured I would pull the tank down, see what's inside it. Um, I drained it and it looked like varnish. So there wasn't much in there, but I'm definitely gonna clean out this gas tank before we do anything with it. All right, so I got the parts I needed, maybe. Uh, I got the, I pulled this out. This was the pickup tube and sending unit. Um, this was, it was cracked. So um, I did find one. This was actually a harder to find piece. Um, I got it on E-Classics, I think so it's called. Um, a lot of the other parts I'm finding on Amazon even, but not this one. Um, I do have a new one. It has the pickup tube and sending unit. So I'm gonna put this into the tank, get it all sealed up so that I can put the tank back in the van. And then hopefully we can try to see if we can start it. All right. So I skipped some steps and I've been working on this just to, I wanted to hear this thing run. All right, so let's take a look at what I've done. I got the gas tank just back up there in a similar, in a temporary fashion. I've replaced the sending unit and drain straw. I did have to replace the fuel pump. Super easy, I jacked it up. Replaced the fuel pump right there. Got a fuel filter. We were having a heck of a time getting it primed. Finally, I read a YouTube video that just said, keep trying, so I tried. And let's see. If running so now we know we've got an engine so now we'll look at what we're gonna do next 